Hello! Today I'm going to talk about my contribution to the FEMO World project. So FEMO is turning 50 years um, this year, so they are making a huge project where you can send in a 10 by 10 centimeter tile, entirely made of FEMO, and then they are going to make a huge globe of all the tiles and put them together and showcase them at the next FEMO symposium. So it's it's a quite a fun project and um, since I've been using FEMO well for eight nine years by now and it's it's um, it's my main my my main medium uh, I thought it would be um, a good idea to to participate. So yeah, so I've been thinking a lot about it and I didn't really know where to go, um, especially since uh, this year I'm making a lot of different things. I started the Happy Bugs project and I'm very interested in insects uh, this year. But uh, food is really what represents me the best, um, so I was brainstorming about um, something about food and I had an idea but uh, it lacked meaning so I was not quite happy with it and last Sunday um, I finally got hit with an idea yay <laughs> so last Sunday the 20 March um, it's the first day of spring but it's also international meat out day so a day where you basically um, the idea is t not to eat meat at all during the day and you might or might not know it but last year I have been doing a daily veggie challenge and the whole idea was to encourage people to eat less meat um, so I'm, I'm, it's, it's a cause that is quite important in my work and has become important and that I feel comfortable uh, working on because I'm so used to sculpting food so it's, it's easy for me to talk about it. Uh, in case you are, you are wondering why, why the no meat, why eat less meat, all that stuff, um, I posted a link just below the video to a blog post I wrote last year um, about the environmental impact of meat consumption. So yeah, so last Sunday um, I realized it was meat out day, so I brainstormed a bit and got the idea to make a veggie burger using uh, or composing with all my miniature food, um, uh, well veggies and bread as well. So I made a tiny hamburger and it was quite fun. I really liked the result. Uh, I made a picture, I posted something on my blog with um, my 10 favorite recipe vegan <laughs> sorry, my 10 uh, favorite vegan recipes. And since I, since I liked the picture so much, I thought, well, that would be actually perfect for the FEMA World project because it's, it will fit easily in a 10 cm by 10 cm tile. And so um, it has meaning, but it's also fun and uh, it's happy and cheerful because I'm not, I mean, for me, environmental um, consideration, ecology, uh, veganism, it's its all very important to me, but I hate the preachy approach from some vegans and I, I do not like the gloomy um, tendency that some people have. So I really am trying my best to make it fun and... Uh, oh, that was my cat, because yeah, I have cats. So I'm, I'm really trying to make it fun and so... Um, I thought that would be a, a great thing, so I just went with that and well, yeah, that's pretty much about it. So it has a bit meaning, so yay, it's, it represents my work because it's miniature food, so another good point. And overall I think it looks pretty awesome. Okay, that, that seemed arrogant. I think it looks nice, <laughs> I'm really happy with the result. And it was fastish in the end. It took me just one day, uh, two days, not counting, of course, the video making that always takes a little bit more time. 
uh, since I already had some all the breads I had um, on stock so I didn't have to redo them and I had some veggies on stock and I just made a few more veggies that I'm sort of showing you how to make in this video although it's not really a tutorial based thing and the pink tile as you saw is also made from Fimo so yeah it was a fun project and you still have time to participate because it's um, it's end of April so I'm leaving also a link to the Fimo world project and if you like Fimo if you use Fimo a lot maybe it would be fun for you to participate as well uh, anyone can participate in fact my own boyfriend who is not a sculptor is going to participate <laughs> And I'm, he has a great idea and I hope he's going to make it. I'm going to help him a bit. And at the end of the whole project, they're going to auction this and give them to charity. So it's, it's all good, really. So anyway, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye!